Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, thank you for clicking on today's video. I don't know what I've called this video, but I will be trying on winter outfit ideas. Um, there's not too many jackets involved in this because I kind of feel like in winter you just wear whatever is cosy. Um, but I've tried to give some kind of basic, basic, I might call it like basic winter outfits because you can definitely dress them up if you want or you can change them to suit your style best. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you do and let's get on with the video. So the first outfit we have is giving definitely more smart casual vibes. So I've got cargo trousers on from Pull and Bear I think. And then I've just added red trainers just for a pop of colour. So yeah, these are just the... I don't even know what the Puma suede. Is that what they are? I got these second hand on Vinted for £20. Blazer is from Boohoo. Really old. Can't find one. I found a similar one on Pretty Little Thing, so I'll link that below. And then this bodysuit is actually from Hollister. Again, I can't find the exact one, but they do have square neck bodysuits on their website is just that they're long sleeve. It is really hot in this house but I would normally wear like a cardigan or jumper underneath the blazer to kind of hide it because I don't want the cardigan to be the main part of the outfit but I also want some extra warmth. But kind of a smart casual vibe like very simple, very plain, very basic but also you feel kind of put together and I've obviously got the pop colour in the trainers and you could definitely add a pop colour with like a matching bag or like a scarf or accessories. It's simple, basic, and it's comfortable, and it's good for the office, so I personally love. So this is the next outfit. I'm going to take my hat off because I'm so warm. So as you can see, I've got on my little Uggs. So these are actually my thermal leggings from Marks and Spencers. And then I've got my thermal top on, and I've got cardigan hidden underneath. Bag from Uniqlo, and this is from Zara. And then I think this is from Primark. Okay, I have actually just taken my jacket off. We're using a different camera because my other camera battery died. But um, jumper is just a wee one from Pool and Bear. So soft, but I normally put it under so many of my like blazers and outfits just because it is so soft and it does hide really well underneath the blazers. But yeah, these bags are really cute. I want to get one in the black, but by summer I think I'll use this a lot more. Pretty simple, pretty basic. You can also obviously accessorise with any jumper you want and switch up the colour palette which is the beauty of having like just a black thermal base and you'll be cosy. Okay so next up is this one here. So I feel like this isn't very flattering on the camera but it is flattering in real life I swear. So this blazer I love. I got this in the January sales last year from Because of Alice. I love the cinch in detail. I did buy the matching trousers but I'm not wearing them with this one because I feel like you got to get the most out of your little. If you get a suit you need to wear it with other things. Honestly the quality of this blazer is just unreal. That's all I can say and I love the colour. I don't wear this blazer enough but I absolutely love it. So it's got the belt here that cinches, I can't say cinch. It's got the belt here that cinches you in and I just love the shape that it creates. I do find this blazer a little bit too long if it's not cinched on me. Um, and then I just paired it with my kind of grey black jeans from Zara and then my Puma Palermo's. You definitely could wear boots with this or if you want to dress it up maybe you could put um, longer jeans and heels or you can buy the matching trousers and wear that as well. There is many ways you can up this outfit or, you know, make it fancier or make it less fancy. It's entirely up to yourselves. And I think if I was going out in the winter with this, I would just chuck a long wool jacket over the top. It, or you could do what I've mentioned earlier and get a cardigan or something just to add a few extra layers. I have kept on the thermal top from Marks and Spencers just to show you. But again, you could put a nicer top underneath this if this is going to be your jacket. There's lots of ways you can dress this up and down. But I quite like wearing this for the office because it's kind of smart casual. Like I feel good in this, um, but it is quite casual. I've worn it out for a meal with my boyfriend as well. And I do love wearing it with matching trousers. But for today, we are not doing the matching trousers, but... This colour is honestly so, so nice. Like I just, 
I just love it. I can't, it's, it's like a bluey kind of green, but I just absolutely love it. Okay, so next up we have this. I feel like it is a fairly simple put together outfit. And then we've got my um, fake Uggs from, where are they from? Public Desire. Not Eagle, Public Desire. So I feel like this is fairly simple, fairly basic, although I feel put together in it. So this is a Zara bomber. Now I feel like a lot of people have the leather Zara jacket that's more of a biker style. So if you have this, that would work too. Or any bomber jacket. I know the bomber jacket from Zara went viral not that long ago. And then Boohoo have loads of cute and comfortable bombers. So I did take inspiration for this one from Pinterest. And I feel like it's just, it is very much a basic outfit. I've not done it here, but what you can do is, again, a little cardigan, a cropped cardigan, would just fit under this so perfectly. And I don't actually have, I really want to get like a fluffy cardigan that's high neck that will button up here because I think I would do that with this and replace the jacket if I wanted to or add that as a layer piece and then zip this up maybe so you can't see it when you're out and about. I feel comfortable, I feel put together, like if I wore this, running errands I would be asking my boyfriend to take a pic because I feel good <laughs> so next up is one of my favorites so let me pan down obviously you'll see the outfit pics my I bought some boots from Stradivarius um yeah let's do this so this is one of my honestly favorites comfiest go-to so this is just a long I'm really bloated after lunch okay so this is one of my more go-to outfits and um, I wore this out for lunch yesterday but I wore a different jumper although I'm quite enjoying the stripy look so this jumper is an old one from Primark but stripy jumpers are just everywhere so I will link similar ones below this dress is actually um, so it's a long sleeve medaxi dress kind of like a skims dupe so I've only got this recently and I love it. It's so stretchy, so comfy, so soft. Like I just feel secure in it and I don't really like my tummy that much. So I like when I wear jumpers like this that hides it. Then I got my Uniqlo bag as well. And then I will just quickly show you what jacket I wore because I love that jacket so much. So this is the jacket here. It is a big puffer jacket from NAKD and it cinches in at the waist with a tie. I've got like my jumper bulging here so it's not the not the prettiest look right now but this jacket is so comfy and cozy I love the tie it is a bit frustrating if I don't want to wear it zipped up with a tie but I can get past that I can just take it off I will link this one down below however if you go on TikTok shop I have seen these jackets going all over TikTok so if you want to try this out I would maybe head to TikTok shop but I'm getting too hot already I feel like a marshmallow so the final outfit is, I'm unsure. So I got these cargo trousers from a Zara haul a while back. I actually never posted the Zara haul, but I got these in the Zara sale. Um, they're just like cargo jeans. My mum my wonderfully cropped them for me because I'm small. I'm not sure how to style them. So I put together this outfit here. I'm unsure if I've got... I don't think the blazer's the right thing. Also, I know it looks tight here, but it's fine. I'm unsure if the blazer's the right thing. Like, see if I take this off. So I'm fine with this. It's just the jacket. I feel like I need, I don't need, I feel like I want um, an oversized bomber that's not cropped. Because I've got my Zara cropped one. But I just don't think the crop would work. Not with my jumper. So, any ideas? I don't think the blazer was too bad, but I feel like it took away from the shape, so then maybe you just layer a lot of thermals under there. But I love these jeans so much. I got them in sale, so I don't know if they will be available, but cargo jeans are kind of in. Kind of in. Yeah, they'll definitely be similar ones on Zara or Pull and Bear or Bershka or all of the above. But I wear this jumper from H&M, by the way, all the time. I feel like that striped jumper I wore with the dress would look nice with this as well. 
and I feel like a, a fitted t-shirt, like a Skims kind of t-shirt vibe with maybe a crop bomber then would work. Right, so there's a, maybe I'll do a wee TikTok on how to style it, so follow me on there. So that was everything in my video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. It's very simple looks. I like doing these videos to kind of give myself ideas on what I can wear during the week at the office and stuff. So I really hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you did. Feel free to leave any suggestions in the comments and I will see you in my next video.